In this tutorial, I'll show you how to change the speed of your particle simulations in Blender. So for an example, I'm just going to start by adding a UV sphere and I'll shade it smooth. And then I'll go right over here to the particles. I'll click on the plus here to add a new particle system. And I'll press the space bar to play and you can see there's the particles. So there are a few different ways to change the speed of your particle simulation. One way to do it is to go here to the physics tab. So just open up the physics and you can go down here to the integration and then you can change the time step. So if I just play this, let's just change the time step to one. Now you can see they're going very fast, or maybe if I just change this to a 0 0.01, now you can see the particles are moving much slower. Now another way that you can change the speed of the particles is to change the gravity. So if you click right here on the field weights tab, just open up the field weights, you can see there is gravity. So if I turn the gravity to zero, now if I play this, you can see they're just kind of floating out. Or if I turn the gravity up maybe to like a 10, so it's really strong, you can see it's falling down much stronger. However, this isn't actually changing the speed of the simulation, it's just changing the gravity. But if you have particles falling and you want them to fall much faster, you could turn up the gravity and then the gravity is going to pull the particles down much faster. Now another way to change the speed of the particles is to change the velocity. And the velocity is the speed which the particles are being emitted out of the object. So if you open up the velocity tab right here, you can change this first normal value. So I'm going to turn this up to like a 10. And now you can see they're moving out much faster at the starting. But then because there is gravity turned on, they still are kind of falling down after they shoot out. I could turn this maybe up even more to like 100. So now they're going to shoot out really, really fast. So that's another great way to change the speed of your particles by changing that velocity normal. However, you can see when it's farther away, they do slow down a little bit. So probably the best way to change the speed is to go to the physics integration and just change the time step right here. So that's it for this video. I hope you found this helpful and thank you for watching. And you can definitely check out my Blender Quick Tips tutorial playlist if you'd like to learn more tips in Blender. And if you'd like to help support me and this YouTube channel, then you can check out my Gumroad store and my Patreon page with the links in the description. But I hope you found this helpful and thanks for watching.